Seminole Boosters is announcing today the Elevate yep. Champions campaign, which is fundraising for women's athletics at FSU. And we've got a legend by my side right now, Gabrielle Reese, who's a former Florida State volleyball star. What would you say about the importance of getting behind and supporting the Elevate Champions campaign? Just knowing that you are not only supporting, you know, athletes and champions and winning and losing, but you're supporting young women in their lives and what they'll do after college. Most athletes will not play professionally, so it will be how they become, you know, in their businesses, parents and other members of, of society. And, and also, I want to just thank Tallahassee for making a home for me uh, when I really needed it and really helped me so much. It's not just about height. Hi, how are you? I think before I came to FSU, I don't know that I even thought about playing. I certainly didn't think about going to college. This environment gave me structure. It gave me uh, a mentor and a coach in Cecile. I was probably heading in one direction by coming to Florida State and playing volleyball here, it changed the complete trajectory of my future. To be asked to be a spokesperson for this campaign is a, is a real honor to me because if I can halfway represent the potential of what women's athletics can do for a, a girl, a woman, I feel really fortunate. Join us as we welcome volleyball athlete alumni and FSU Hall of Famer Gabrielle Reese back to Tallahassee. The real conversation I've been hearing for the last two days since I've been here is the importance of creating the best possible environment for the athletes. What I have seen at Florida State is that they gravitate towards hiring coaches that are trying to be truly good leaders, which is how do we develop these people to be their very best selves and how do we create environments for them to maximize all of who they are. purposely try to avoid her as much as possible? What? They are or you just try to blast the ball at her? Oh, they're she's been hit many They're like, times. get out of the way. They How are super protective. Like, yeah. To the point where I'm like, guys, I'm not that fragile. I'm going to introduce myself. I'm Gabby. I'm Jelia. Hi. Nice where are you from? Serbia. Nice. So I brought one of my teammates. Hi, girls. Um, Hi. This is Tawana Taylor. She was Tawana Walker when we played together. We're still Hi. friends. So this is an example. You can still be friends. Um, and then, Jen, just say hi. Jen played at Pepperdine, but she was a professional beach player with me. And we've been friends for 30 years. So, But I just wanted to just say hi. I mean, obviously, we played here a long, long time ago, and it was uh, probably the most impactful four years of my life that really helped me, whether you play beyond. I mean, I went and played professionally because I was still in love with volleyball. Um, I wasn't burnt out yet. If you ask my freshman year class, there was eight of us on the team of 12, eight freshmen. Can you imagine what that looked like? And I think if you said, who here may not make it, it would have been me, I think. <laughs> Truthfully, I think, right? Yeah, I mean, I think my teammates, they were all really dialed in. Chicago players, all these other players. I came from St. Thomas and I was kind of like, okay. I really learned how to play here. Being on a team, having a common goal and achieving those goals, I think that is a really powerful experience. I'm excited for you guys. I am a person that says no to everything. I want to be with my family, I want to be training. But when something like this opportunity comes up, there is no decision to be made. To show up for this message about supporting, you know, women's athletics, man, it's powerful. You could, you could launch a lot of strong, smart, tough women into the world and that will become moms and bosses. You're you, the person, and one of the things you do is play volleyball. 
This is not your whole identity. You're way more than this. And so I know that's hard because you guys have all been doing this for a really long time. The fact if you're tall, you walk around, are you an athlete or are you a volleyball player? It's like, no, I'm Gabby. And one of the things I've done is play volleyball.